So I wanted to do a book review today on a book that I have um, read and reread multiple times. I apparently started writing what year I read the, uh, this book in um, and I just finished it recently and I don't know why but I haven't got like a full review of this book um, anywhere um, written down or on my channel or anything like that so I thought I'd do that today because I really like this book. I know that a lot of people um, know about Courtney Summers from her book Sadie but she did actually write um, a handful of books before Sadie got popular so um, yeah I thought that the, for the people that enjoy Courtney Summers and, and likes the book Sadie maybe you should consider picking up some of her other books because I don't hear a lot of people talk about um, her backlog as much. So this book is called Some Girls Are by Courtney Summers. I think this was the second book that she's ever written and it follows a 17, 18 year old girl in high school named Regina who's a part of this popular clique in high school. Um, something happens to her in the very beginning of the book um, that happened at a party and um, the next week when she goes back to school someone has spread this really vicious rumor about her and it sort of made everyone in the school hate her including the the people that she was um, originally friends with um, not only do they end up hating her but they end up basically bullying her because of this rumor that was spread um that's all i'm gonna say about it because i think you i think that's enough um of you to um enough information for you to to go into this book with um one thing that i absolutely loved about this book is the characters mostly because i have read a lot of like YA coming of age contemporary type books in my time reading and um, um, I've never come across one quite like Courtney Summers books. I find her books really realistic in her characters. Her characters feel very three-dimensional very non-stereotypical and if even if there is a slight stereotype she uses it as a tool to um to broaden the the plot or broaden who they are as a character basically um so i really like i personally really like regina as a main character yes she is a victim of these rumors that have been going around but uh, throughout the book as you're reading it you find out more and more about who she was in the past before this whole incident happened and you end up not really liking her that much and I think what Courtney Summers does really well is sort of um, portray someone who wasn't a very good person and so you should feel like she sort of there are moments in it where you feel like she sort of deserves everything that's happened to her but also you kind of feel bad for her because because she is still a victim of these vicious rumors and i guess what this whole book explores is how these rumors that happen in high school especially within girls and, and, and girl friend groups and things like that can really destroy a person emotionally and mentally which um, I, I really I really I've never seen anyone else do that um, quite as well as Courtney Summers um, the other thing that I really like about this book is the the way she uh, paints a picture of high school it doesn't feel um, cookie cutter and clean and bright and optimistic as a lot of books tend to do with high school because that's not really it might be some people's experience but it's not everyone's experience and I and I like how how realistic she makes high school 
feel in all of her books. I've only read three of her books so far and all three of them do follow people in high school and I find that she does that in, in all of her, her books. Like high school feels a lot more um, like bleak and a little bit greedy and like a little bit sad to be completely honest and I, I really like that. Um, so yeah, I, I really like the characters. I think she's really, really good with characters. When it comes to writing style, I can't really say too much about it just because her writing style is not overly flowery, but they definitely are um, that sort of blunt kind of writing style that um, just gets to the point if that makes sense and I and I think that really fits the story really well um, when it comes to something I didn't like I mean I've read this book three times now and I can't quite find anything I didn't really like about it the only thing I will say which isn't really a criticism but it's just a preference thing so this whole book is a contemporary drama um, coming of age dark coming of age type story it's not it's it's about Regina as a character and it's about her experience in high school although there is a little bit a slight little bit of romance in this um, but it doesn't overshadow what Regina is going through and I think sometimes there are moments in this book where I wish the romance would kind of play out a little bit more stronger in the book I guess in in the plot but I understand why it's not because it's not about the romance um so that's kind of like if I were to give a negative of this book that that's something that I will um mention but other than that i really 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 love this book I think it's really well written I think it's a really good coming of age book and um, yeah if you haven't picked it up I definitely highly recommend and um, let me know if you've read this book down in the comments below and yeah I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you next time